I just took my hair out. Since being evicted, it's been in that stiff ponytail with curls since. And uh, it was so short that I forgot how big my hair really is. Uh, uh, growth. It's in need of a wash. I guess with the growth of my hair, so am I. Nothing's perfect. Nothing's good. Quiet. But still a work in progress, especially the current situation, if you think what I'm saying. Anyhow. I hope y'all's weekend is going well. Mine is gone. Working. On a lot of things. Staying at a drill that I don't belong in. I don't got no friends. And I don't be with nobody. I just want to clarify and rectify that. If old Susanna is running around with my papers. Don't care if she come from Alabama. That bitch ain't me. Okay. Hi, Alabama. And he... I just wanted to make a present entrance and now I'm about to make a present exit off of this here. Yeah. I still feel some type of way about people using my passport and IDs and doing that. Uh, what is that? That ID me? I haven't done that yet. Someone told me to do it so that way they can better identify me. And I'm like, as if you can't already identify me with my uh, passport. I mean, sure, I'm bald-headed in my passport. I got a little snatch nugget. I don't got this. Maybe I need a new passport picture. Been thinking about canceling my passport since I know someone is utilizing it. But it's my only means of identification and seeing as though people made sure that they tapped me out of my money. You know, financial abuse and all. I like to say that my lawyer is handling that and he's going to get my stuff back to me post haste. Mm. I claims it. Why wouldn't I? Everybody else claims something that don't belong to them. My stuff. Mine. Uh, and then they want to say you crying over spilled milk. I keep on saying to you, dear, that I did not spill any milk for me to be crying over. You stole something. That means you made a mistake. And you got caught. So spilt milk is not what it is. Complete theft is what it is. Now organize this in your little organizing planner. Don't put me in any bullshit. 
that you know I have nothing to do with while you're doing all of that fraud on my name and person. You know, making a person homeless, you probably thought that that was going to change the dynamics on how organized your situation towards my situation would be. When in fact, it is the total opposite of that. I'm just going to leave it at that. Anywho. I love those that truly do love me back with everything I got in me. I do. And thank you for not being fake. Hmm. Doppelganger, sisters, I mean, siblings. You already know what's coming for you. I'm not going to babysit your feelings because you damn sure don't babysit mine. And you surely didn't babysit mine when you were stepping and tapping and stepping all on my name and information. You forgery ass people, you. I'm disappointed in you. While you eating your Sunday dinner tomorrow and they have a family day. I hope y'all not on a, in the group chat using me as gossip material. You might want to have something better to do and talk about. Yeah, because lying on me in the group chat and doing all that extra yeah, is not necessary. I'm not even in there to defend myself. I mean, if you're going to talk about me, add me to it. <laughs> I mean, if it's true, right? Right? Or maybe people just like to live in Fantasy Island. Because it's better to kick somebody while they're already down. Slander and defame them further. Than to actually do what family is supposed to do. What friends are for out this month. I mean, y'all just run around here singing in good times and bad times. Y'all bullshit out this motherfucker for real. Forevermore. Anywho. <laughs> Yo, one thing about me is you put me through everything under the sun. And they have. But you won't stop my shine. You won't stop my smile. You won't stop the happiness within me. You could fuck with everything around me. And it still won't change my light towards people. As you would like for me to be. Okay. I'm not my cousin. My cousin is bipolar. Okay. Hey, girl. I ain't gonna say your name, but you know who you are. We look alike. Love you anyway. But you a fraud. You all up in my name and mentions, too. Done tapped into some things. You know that missing money thing that they online unclaimed this and that? Yeah. She used herself to access my things. I mean, we look like we ain't twin twins, though. I see people that I'm personally not related to at all. And we look exactly the same. It's the scariest thing. I never knew what a doppelganger was until I came across those women. <laughs> Some of them are actually family members, and I'm waiting for you to actually say, hey, Even though you did what you did. I'm very forgiving. But you just gotta step up. I don't even know if you're willing. But don't wait till they come and collect you. 
and do federal time. I was you, I put a move on it. You see, because I didn't do anything wrong. I'm the one who was wronged in many fraudulent, organized, crimeish ways. And I won't get into it anymore too tough about it because I already know who's watching what and why you're watching. You want to know my response. You want to know what I'm going to say. You want to know what I know. You want to know how I'm feeling. You want to see if you're going to see a tear come down my eyes like Jay-Z. I can't see him coming down. Every time you project some more things for me to feel my way, I can't. It's draining. But I don't feel like being drained. No. Mm -mm -mm. I'm going to get through this. Planned, plotted bullshit. That y'all put me through. I'm grateful. Very grateful. To a lot of people. Including you guys. Because you just show me who you are. And you show me what a dollar could do. And make you switch on your own. People. Willing to do a little strange lion for some change on a lion. That be me. Yes. Yes. Uh, anywho. I miss those that miss me. I wouldn't know who misses me, you know, because I don't talk to anybody. I'm solo dolo on the real though. So, who claim me need to step up? I mean, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? I don't want anybody running around here talking about they run around with this nana because you're not. What am I, in, in an invisible seat with you guys? Come on. I need them real because all I do is see fake. I'm starting to think that this planet is artificial. You know, because as soon as you get a little change, you turn into a cartoon. Fake. Money could never change me in that way. I'm helpful. Some of you don't even like that. Can't stand it. It bothers you. It irks your body. You would rather me be quiet. You would rather me be gone. Oh, yeah, and to whoever's doing the insurance policy on me, stop it. I'm saying here loud and clear, I don't give anybody power of attorney. Uh, um, what is that other shit? Proxy to my, to anything. Inheritance, nothing of mine, just nothing of mine. You are allowed to touch. You are, you're, I do not give you to go. I never gave you to go in the past. I didn't give you a go in the present, and I don't give you the go in the future. Okay? We don't talk, we don't communicate, and just because I'm around you does not mean that that was a yes that you could do so because you cannot. I'm saying no. Don't nothing get shaken unless it comes through me. You know, y'all like to forge handwritings and lie to judges and whatnot like that and doctor up medical papers and make people seem like they're uh, mental. How insulting. And scanning all of my papers that I had to scan all week. Yeah, and put them in the old chips like that. None of them, and I do mean none of them, 
and any type of iota <laughs> of me being mentally challenged, bipolar, schizophrenic, none of that bullshit that you lied on document to gain access to my property, to deem me unfit to handle my own property and assets that you stole from me in a major way. I want to put that out there because I don't like how you guys tried that shit on me before you got me illegally evicted. Yeah. Yeah. I'm still mad at upstairs looking like B&B &B and me living downstairs in squalor. Left to fix and patch up little things on my own. Like I didn't have a landlord or a management company in the first place. To come and correct those things for me. Living in there since 2013. Never moving, but people playing even mail fraud. You moved my mail around from place to place. Old residents that I lived in and... The same residence that I lived in in another side of town. I don't know how the city got two of the same addresses in the same city. I don't get it. Hey. Hey. Anyway, when you look into that, you'll see that I'm not lying. And if you can't find it, don't worry. I will gladly show you because I could, I could just put it in a PDF for you and print it out. I could just post it on YouTube and let you see it for yourself because I don't have time to babysit that shit. It's what you did. You violated me in a major way. I beg your pardon. Anywho. Here's a little tip for you. I don't like anyone playing on my mentality, my intellect, my gifts, my know-how, my contents, my very essence of being me. It's disgusting. Mm. And it has to be corrected. But that you already know because just like they're watching me and you're watching me, they're watching you too. I'm grateful for that. Hmm. Which means you have not much time to be playing with me at all. Like the brother in uh, Night of the Living Dead. They're coming to get you, Deborah. I mean, Barbara. <laughs> Such a jackass sometimes I could be. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry, I didn't have any Solomon fish. I mean, salmon fish. That's how much disrespect I got disrespected while living in that unit. Upstairs looking like Airbnb. Me being watched. Exploited. Violated. Disrespected. Used. Unbeknownst to me. Until, you know, someone asked me, hey, if there was any place that you would rather not be watched while in there, where would it be? And I say, the bathroom. You're watching me for my safety. Thank you. But the rest of y'all was watching me to exploit me. Use 
the fact that you knew me for clout. Violate me on tenders and only apps and things like that. Traffic me. You did a lot. And you know what? When you want to act like uh, you want to add a little bit more slander and say, I don't know what I'm talking about, I always say to you, the day that they ever put a lie detector test and strapped me to it, a lot of y'all already know. You blew it, right? Because I have no reason to lie, right? All that you took shall be returned to me. I claim that. Humbly. Hmm. I don't care who's mad. I don't care who's jealous. I don't care who's upset. I don't care. I care about all that you took from me. All that you kept secret. That is mine. I'm ready to air it all out. Do the dirty laundry like I'm Kelly rolling out this mother and get the ball rolling on you mother. You understand me? I know you do. Love to those who love me back. I hope that your weekend is safe and happy. Yeah, I really do. And thank you for being you. Take care now. <laughs>